Well, I, I tell you, we've, uh, we went on a four-game road swing. We came back home. We finally got to play in the uh, field house. And very pleased. We played really hard. We beat a very good Prairie View team who came back and beat Marshall today. And Marshall's out of the, a very, very tough conference, I think Conference USA. And, and then we come back out against Sam Houston and we play extremely well. We have a 29-point lead, I believe, at halftime. And we're hitting full cylinders. And we did this without Shantae Goff. Uh, who bruised, uh, who has a deep bone bruise and she'll be back pretty soon. Then we did it without Michelle Hyman who really has been playing spectacular. And so the injuries, <laughs> can't have any more. I can't have any more, but, but we play hard. I'm very pleased that we share the ball and uh, we're pretty deep. So, and, and you, you saw some players step up today, and that was good. Players, uh, Mary Savoy, just let alone this uh, tournament MVP, but just her coming back from the injury last year. Just how have you seen her kind of get better up to this point? Well, not only did she come back from a broken hand, she's had a concussion and missed about eight weeks. So we're glad to have her back in the swing of things. If I can everybody healthy, I think we're going to have a pretty good shot to make a run because our defense is up tempo, and when we play up tempo, then. Uh, we're, we're pretty good. Coach, Angela Villarreal played more today with the guard injuries. What did you see from her? Uh, I moved Angie off of the ball. Uh, Angie's been a point guard. It was, and, and when I move her off the ball, then she tends to uh, get into the offense a little bit better. And so she's passing more. Now she got open for shots, and she's a good shooter. But I had to get her off the ball because we got to move the ball a little bit quicker. And I've turned her into a two guard and into a pretty good one. She knocked down some threes in this one. Is that something she's been working on especially yeah, lately? Yeah, we've been working on it a lot. We've been working on her pull-up jumper a lot. And uh, I see good things ahead for not only Angie, but for the team. I mean, Michelle Hyman is playing at a high level. Bernicia Peters at a high level. Adele Turk at a high level. And guys, those are sophomores. Chance to play more minutes in this game. How did you feel about your own play in this one? Um, I felt, I mean, a little more confident after a while. I mean, once I got in, it's just, you know, Got to get rid of the jitters and everything, but uh, my teammates encouraged me. They uh, told me, you know, this is what you're here for. You're here on this team for a reason, and um, I guess it showed. I had fun, so. You looked very comfortable shooting, especially from outside. How much is that something you've been working on? Um, lately, it's been something I've been working on in practice. I mean, usually I'm a driver. I usually get, you know, layups or stuff like that, but uh, once I took the first shot, I just I felt like tonight I should be shooting, so um, just kept shooting and started going in, so it was a good night for me anyway. What are some of the other strengths you're going to bring or areas you've improved since last year? Uh, since last year, for sure, defense. I mean, uh, Gabe, uh, Coach Gabe's always on me on defense, for sure. Uh, offensively, yeah, I mean, they have me handling the ball sometimes, uh, taking it in, driving and everything, but defensively is what I've been wanting to get better at so that I could help the team because that's ultimately when it's going to come down to in a really heavy pressure game is defense.